Have you ever felt as though the universe is trying to send you a message, something deeper, beyond mere coincidence? Perhaps you've noticed a specific number sequence repeating in your life, catching your eye in the most unexpected places. Could these be signs from beyond, calling out to your spirit? The truth is, they might just be. Imagine for a moment the possibility that these recurring numbers, whether it's 111, 333, or 777, are more than a strange pattern, they are keys to understanding the guidance of your higher self. The great spiritual leaders of the past, such as Pythagoras, have long understood the mystical power of numbers, claiming that the universe itself is written in this language. Now, it's your time to decode it and discover your personal connection to angelic wisdom. Angel numbers, unique to each of us, are the celestial codes that help align our lives with our soul's purpose. Every time you encounter a specific number, it's an opportunity to pause, reflect, and realign with the universe's plan for you. For instance, the number 111, often considered the number of manifestation, signals that your thoughts are rapidly becoming reality. If you've been dwelling on a desire or dream, seeing 111 is a nudge from your angels to focus on positive outcomes because the universe is ready to respond. Perhaps you've seen the number 333 repeatedly. This is no accident. It's a divine reminder that you are surrounded by loving energies, and your spiritual guides are near, offering you protection and encouragement. Each angel number holds a distinct vibration, tailored to the lessons and blessings you need at that very moment. Understanding these numbers allows you to consciously connect with your angels and walk in harmony with their divine guidance. So how do you find your own angel number connection? It begins with awareness. Start by paying attention to the numbers that appear to you in everyday life. Are you ready to uncover the meaning behind your angel numbers? What number has been appearing in your life lately? 